the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Love you. Hey everybody, God bless you. We're going to sit there and we got a great topic today. <laughs> and that topic is social constructs basically created to judge other people. And what Brother Addison and I, we, we, we don't had some backstage talking and discussion, but I want to at least get some scriptures in today to talk about, to back up what we're talking about. Uh, so one of the things about my social construct to everybody is the fact that it's used to divide and put people and label people and continue to be done today. We talk about social constructs that call all the way from the caste system, slavery, uh, middle class, upper class. We talk about even social constructs in our political parties. All these things are done and in, in, in some cases is used, using the social construct to justify, to me, always saying bad behavior. And as a believer, and Brother Addison was talking about it, as a believer, we need to understand is that you, you either conform to the way of Christ, Christ's teaching. John, what, 14, 6, he said, Jesus, I'm the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father but by me. That's very clear. And yet we have social constructs that, that may be satisfactory to whoever is going to benefit from it but it does not benefit your eternal life. And one of the scriptures right here, Brother Addison, I'm gonna show you and everybody that's listening, is this, start off with this one right here. We, we got the salvation piece, Romans 10, but I'm really looking at Matthew 7, 21. Okay. Cause I think people need to get this. All right, it reads. Not everyone that says unto me, Lord, Lord, shall enter into the kingdom of heaven. Mm -mm. But he that doeth the will of my Father, which Come is on. in heaven, many will say to me in that day, Lord, Lord, have we not pro prophesied in thy name? And in thy name have cast out devils, and in thy name done many wonderful works. And then will I profess unto them, I never knew you. Depart from me, ye that work iniquity. Now, I don't think you have, do, can you explain to people what the significance of this? I mean, I mean, whatever we try to do in this lifetime, if 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 it's not following after righteousness, it's not following after godliness, it's not following after holiness, there's, there's consequences eternally. Now, there, you know, there's brother Adam, those some people don't believe that there's anything after that. That's up, that's their choice. Yeah. But what's written is what we have to to for believers need to go by. And I'm concerned about people who profess to be something and not understanding that you can't just like we brother for people uh that is joining in, brother Isaac was talking the fact that our country is building two pillars. There's a concept of idea of freedom and there's a concept of of not freedom, of slavery, and all that other stuff. There's an institution of racism and everything else that was built on the other side. So you got, to me, it's almost like two, two worlds, two realities that built this country. And and I think we need to understand is, regardless of what we build, regardless of what greatness we build, we all got to give an account to God. In the end, we all have to do that. And we don't need to be led and, and, and directed to do things contrary to God's will. So so based on that, well, how do you read that, your perspective is the same here? Because 21, 21 is a key, that's a key component in 21, isn't it? Yeah, well, the thing is, uh, we, we've said this prior too, the, the word of God has been used as a weapon since the beginning of time, and it has been used to uplift an individuals yeah. for personal gain 
And so, though you can use the word and have faith in the word being done, if it's not done in love, then it's done in vain. Mm -hmm. And so it's not done to further the kingdom of heaven. It's not done to uplift the kingdom of heaven. It's done to do self-elevation. Yeah. And I so, call it vain glory, Paige. Yes. So herein you have people who have lived that life in that manner coming to Yeshua saying, you know, haven't we done such and such? Yeah. Yeah. You know, and maybe you have, but I I, I don't know you. <laughs> I don't know you. Your heart won't write. Yeah. God judges the heart of man, right? Yeah. You know, so if, and, if, if you didn't receive me <laughs> as your Lord and Savior, come on, come that on. means I did not put that in you to do what you did. Right. And, 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 and Paul <laughs> said, Paul said, you know, whether they try and tear me down or not, uh -huh. Christ is still preached. It's still preached. And, and the thing, and that's what, yeah, and that's what I think about, you know, think about it. The two ideas and concept of, of this country, we're talking about this country, and we're talking about the, the concept of freedom, and even free, they came here for the freedom of religion, and yet there's some devilish things that happen on the other reality, right? The, the, the even, even talk about the Native American piece, right? How they, how they were wiped out, or really, we talked about earlier, some, well, some of them were just relabeled to be <laughs> Africans. Yeah. But, but the point is, you took a culture in society that was already existing. They and even thriving. had to, and thriving. thriving, yeah. And uh, here's a good, here's a, really, here's a real good concept. They were living with the land, not destroying the not land. Destroying. You know, or, they or moved. even destroying the people in it. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I'm, and, and when I say that, their existence, their very contact with others did not bring about sickness and disease. Exactly. And I was like, is that, how about the animals too, right? You know how yeah. they, they, like the Native Americans, a lot of them would move, move when the, the herd moved. Right. In other words, we we came with the concept is no, we're gonna control the herd. We're gonna put a boundary on the herd, right? Yeah. We, we're gonna put fences and everything else to keep the herd. So we don't follow the herd no more. We're gonna follow you. Go, the herd stays here, and we stay here. In some cases, where herds get sick or something, they kill all of them. You know, all that well, other stuff. Their, their concept was, we're gonna make nature adapt to us, and not yes, us adapt we, to exactly, yeah. And, and that, that's that's the the whole uh, uh, premise of mm -hmm. civilization. Yeah, yeah. You, know, you you make society form to our benefit instead of yeah. Us. And then um, we talk about. As a matter of fact, that made me think about the 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 with the 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 climate, right? The the yeah. the environment and how. Our industrial living has has really endangered the environment, and you got some fighting to continue to destroy the environment. Mm -hmm. And then you have people who put poison chemicals in the in the river uh, that people drink from, <laughs> right? Yeah, because they're not going to drink from it. <laughs> yeah. I mean, they, got, they get the money that the poison is giving them so that they can go buy water elsewhere. <laughs> and that's not fair. I mean, you're talking about endangering stuff. You're talking about the, even the pipeline, right? The, remember that, the, the pipeline? Oh, yeah. my goodness. And they still it, made that pipeline. You still, are, they, I mean, these people have lived, try to live according to a treaty that, that really was not necessary according to them. But because of the those who are in power, you know, they recognize, okay, well, you existed here prior to us. We've done so much damage. We're gonna give you this land. You can do whatever you want on this land. This is your land. And then centuries later, 
well, we're going to put this in your land whether you want it or not. And the danger that goes along with it, too, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. But, but the fact that they're doing that still in this mm -hmm. day and age, mm -hmm. you know, and, and then will call themselves righteous and, and, and that this nation is above all nations because we do good and, and all these other nations are doing atrocities and, and, and just, <laughs> it just, it just, it's just selfishness, really. It's all right, selfishness. It's a love we of talk money. about yeah. love of money, period. It, and we even polluted the the voting part because of money. They let corporations now. I think one time they think I think they did a rumor, right? Co corporations are citizens too, and and they got the right to put money in to the political process where they end up controlling politicians through how much money they get. Yeah. You know, they and, and they make it hard for, because I think one time it was elections were funded. Remember that it was like, it was so much you could put into the, to the election process so that nobody can take advantage of the, use money as, uh, as a mean of, of buying politicians. Yeah. And they blew that out of the window, didn't they? they now, now it's like, no, you can give all kinds of money to to politicians. Uh, and if they don't they don't need federal funds anymore to run an election, you know, to get into an election. They they get money from, from private donors. You know? And now I can put more money because they look airtime costs a lot of money, don't it? <laughs> to get on the, uh, the, the, the like. But here's the point of Sando is that not everyone says to me, Lord, Lord, turn to the kingdom of heaven. What, what is that, that little piece right there tell, tell, telling you about? Not everybody said, to me it's like, not everybody said they're a Christian or a believer will enter to the kingdom of heaven. How's that? Because there's there's more than lip service. Mm -hmm. It's more than lip service. Come on now. It says you have to believe in your heart and go yeah. with your mouth that he is your Lord. So I like even better the fact that in verse 21 that Peter said, but he that does the will, the will. of yeah. my father who is in heaven. Not you can say, Lord, Lord, all you want. But if you're not going to say, His will be done. Are you, you know what I mean? You see where I'm coming from? Yeah. You, you, can, you, can, you, can, you, can, you can pretend you're doing all. You can lie to me all day long, right? We can lie to each other all day long. But if we're not trying to do the will of the Father, He's saying is, and not everyone has said to me, Lord, let us into the kingdom of heaven, but he that does the will of the Father, right? Yeah. Same thing if you want to say you want to be promoted, right? Uh, you got to do the things that gets promoted. It ain't going to just happen by itself, is it? No. No, no. Uh, you got to get the education. Your work is not the only thing going to get you promoted. And you got some people that sold into that concept that my performance will get me promoted. Nope. <laughs> that, that, it won't, will it? <laughs> I think, I think, it, I guess it fools you to at least make up the E6. But after E6, it becomes another type of, of uh, means of getting promoted. You remember, it's automatic go to the, to the for me the advanced course, right? You know, you get your you get your basic then, and then you go back to the advanced course, but uh, that 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 you have to go to in order to get captain, make captain. For you, y'all had to go to the uh, uh, B not, well, y'all know what y'all call it, but then army called B not, right? And then then it went to you had to go to the senior course. And I think you go to senior course, what, either you promote it or promotable. You go to the well, senior you course. You go through courses, 
that, that don't, the courses for us were pretty much after. Set, yeah. They were set after you were in a position. So, okay. you, you know, there were some courses that prepared you for a position, but didn't get you in a position. There was courses that you had to go through after you were in a position. Mm -hmm. You know, that, that helped you, uh, gave you more knowledge about management or, or supervising, you know, exactly. or, or stuff like that. But uh, everything in for us was more so just testing. You had to yeah. have a knowledge base yeah. of, of, of certain things. And that's just to get you an eighth part of the score. Yeah. The, the score was more than just that, right? Yeah. But you definitely need to get that score. <laughs> yeah. That was a big score, but you had to have uh, awards and, and other classes and everything else to the total airman concept. Your evaluation played a role yeah. in your promotion. You could be you could be a good person to take tests, but if you ain't got a good evaluation, it don't matter. So you have to have all these things to move forward. And I'm sitting in here for believe it or saying you need to do what? His will to move forward, right? Yeah. Because verse 22, what do what you got from that? 22. And he will say to me in that day, Lord, Lord, we have not prophesied. I mean, have we not prophesied in my name? You know, uh, what do you think about that? <laughs> I mean, just because you did it, you did it in vain. I mean, it's, it's, you know, this is, this is, we're going to back toward works. Mm -hmm. We're doing works to get into the kingdom. Any question about this? It's, it's by faith. It, we're, we're not under the law anymore. Yeah. We're under faith. So you can't work yourself into the, you can't do good to get into the kingdom. You're not a performance-based Yeah. Thing. So it's, it's not a do good and get good and do bad and get bad. No, that's not this dispensation anymore. Mm -hmm. This is belief. Right. Right. Except love. Come on there. And then I, I think the thing about you, you you do the you perform the fruits of the spirit. Spirit. Yeah. Right. You know, this stuff is is <laughs> is uh a byproduct. Exactly. But if this is your if this is your product <laughs> this and your right. byproduct is <laughs> Heaven, you're you're <laughs> you're did, did. You, you, you. Yeah, I got cut off. <laughs> Man, it just dropped off. Yeah, I know. It just, it just went all the way off. I said, you must be saying something. You better go ahead and repeat. I, I think I think the, the live caught you, but I, I was just the one that got cut out. <laughs> well, it said recording stopped as soon as you went out. Okay, and that's back on there. Okay. The, the, the point, I'm the, like you're saying, though, is that it's, it's, you can't do it for show. And because the question is saying, have I not prophesied in your name? You you asking that as a question because obviously your prophecy wasn't something that God knew about. Have I done wonderful works? Who determined that you did wonderful works? Yeah. You know what I mean? Who, who made that determination? Who made that determination? Who told the you work, that works are good based on what? On what? <laughs> exactly. Exactly. That's what he's trying to say. It's like we we you know how we judge that you did wonderful works. You did one of the works because you said you did one of the works. Yeah. Yeah. Or somebody else validated it. It wasn't God validating the works. It was people validating the works. Yeah. And yeah, you going. We think we'll get to heaven because of what we think we did. Because that's what they asked the question, isn't it? You know, we we done many wonderful works. We cast out devils. You know, maybe I guess you can know did you cast out a devil or not? I guess you. You didn't did run into the sons of Skiba. Oh, look, you, you still had clothes on. <laughs> so they they felt they were doing some good stuff. 
They were obviously they were casting out. Per, apparently, the way Jesus was talking about, those people casting out devils. Uh, well, I mean, you know, they they may have seen so. Yeah, they did. You know? But Christ said, "You let them tell you. <laughs> if, if you call me the uh, be, uh, Prince of Beelzebub, because I cast out devils, what do you call the people that cast out devils in your midst? Yeah. Did you call them devils too, Prince of Devil?" You know, how the body cannot stand. And and then like you said, that twenty-three, he said, I never knew you. Yeah. Now, your partner knew you, your friends knew you, yeah. right? Your political people party knew you. For, I mean, they probably had them folks worshiping them. And, Come on and, now. Was, and, was, and was allowing it. Come on. They knew you. Right? No, your no, your buddy, no, your no, ride or die. When you do it for for glory. Your glory is your reward, then, not heaven. Exactly. But you're thinking you was getting it for heaven. Yeah. Because that's apparently that's what they asked that question. But Christ said, I never knew you because you didn't do you didn't do it my way. You did it your way. Same as he told Peter, right? Remember Peter? Peter sit there and say, uh, you ain't going, no, no, we ain't gonna take that, Lord. You, you ain't going to, you ain't gonna be killed. Uh-uh. Uh, -uh. uh we, we're gonna stand for you. And what Christ said. Yeah, you're gonna deny me three times, buddy. Yeah, <laughs> you're gonna deny me today. Let, I, me I like... you, let me tell you, how you gonna deny me? <laughs> <laughs> I, I like I like the point he was saying is get behind me, Satan. Yeah. He took he first told the brother the first in that same setting, he told him brother, flesh and blood didn't reveal that to you, Peter. Yeah. But my father was in heaven. And then what, a few verses down later? homeboys in there talking about you ain't gonna die. He said, get behind me, Satan. Yep. We, he looked, everybody probably like, who are you talking to? <laughs> he was talking to Peter. Yeah. <laughs> they probably was looking behind him. <laughs> looking behind him like, who, who, who what? <laughs> I, I thought it was interesting when, when he said, one of y'all will betray me. And when you sit there and say, is it I? Yeah. That, is that an indictment on yourself? Yeah. Because all of them said it to a degree of saying, is it I, Lord? Yeah. I love you. I hope you enjoy the session. Don't forget to subscribe, amen. And don't forget the fact that I need to put that subscribe button back on there. I don't know what happened to it, but we'll get back to that. And, and I'll break down these sections to A, part A, B, 3, you know. A, B, C, and D, but I want you to enjoy and, and, and really digest what we talked about today. And remember, Yeshua, Jesus, Christ, is Lord, and we will do the will of the Father, because we can't go to heaven. We can't go to the Father except through Christ. Amen? God bless you, and I'll see you when I see you, and I hope you enjoy the message. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Love you.